Hi, Hi everyone. everyone. My name is Pasa and this is my project partner, Peter. This is a short video about our project, which is the Renewable Energy Intermittency Management by Complementary Operation of Solar and Wind with Energy Storage. Let's do a quick introduction about our video. Energy consumption is a huge part of our daily lives. We need energy for literally everything to power up homes, drive cars, use technology, you name it. Even while we sleep, we consume energy. Energy simply underpins modern life, and that's why it is the issue of our time. A viable solution is to use renewable energy sources such as wind and solar. One of the biggest pitfalls associated with solar and wind energy is that it only generates electricity at certain times of the day. For example, photovoltaic arrays only generate electricity when it's exposed to sunlight. It means that energy generation may be disrupted during the night or during cloudy days. Studies have however shown that combining solar and wind energy can generate output power that is much more reliable. As mentioned previously, the standalone solar and wind system provide power with fluctuations and cause intermittency issues. This is an example of a sunny day where the PV module is exposed to the sun. As you can see, the light is on, however, say on a cloudy day, where there is not much sun, the light will start flickering. And that's exactly what we mean by intermittency issue. Likewise, in a windy day, the power is generated. But as the wind decreases and decreases, the light starts to flicker. And that's another cause of intermittency issues. Now, the optimal solution is to combine wind and solar with a hybrid energy storage system. In our project, we have implemented a hybrid energy storage system using a supercapacitor and a battery. Now you may ask, why do we have two forms of energy storage system? This is because a supercapacitor has high power density characteristic, while a battery has a high energy characteristic. By combining these two characteristics, we are able to form a much better energy storage system to mitigate the intermittency issues of both wind and solar energy. This is an example of a windy and sunny day, and therefore, the power is delivered to the load. However, when there is no sun and no wind, the hybrid energy storage system will take care of things and deliver power to the load. So, there you have it everyone. Renewable Energy Management 101. Thank you very much for watching this video and I hope you found it informative. Take care everyone. Goodbye.